Bismillahir Rahmanir Rahim how are you students today we will we will uh, study physics uh, topic argon pipes lecture number 36 so first we will define argon pipe an argon pipe is An argon pipe is sound producing element of the pipe organ that resonate at a specific pitch when pressurized air prepper prepper is driven through it each pipe is tuned a specific note of the musical scale a set of organ pipes of similar timbre comprising the complete scale is known as ring one or more ring constitute a stop so argon pipe is sound producing element it produce sound it produces sounds organ pipes are musical instruments which are used to produce musical sounds by resonant air column so musical instrument musical instruments organ pipe is the musical instruments uh, produce musical sound produce musical sound by by resonating air column by resonating air column there are two types of organ pipes closed organ pipe and open organ pipe closed second open closed organ pipe and open organ pipe closed organ first we will stationary waves in open organ pipe stationary waves in open organ pipe an open organ pipe is one which is open at both ends when air was blown into the pipe through one end a wave travel through the tube to the next end from where it is reflected an organ pipe which is open at both end is known as open at both ends so this is an open organ pipe open organ pipe when air is blown into the open organ pipe the molecules of the air column starts vibrating freely at open ends with maximum amplitude as a result anti node will form at both ends and nodes form somewhere inside the pipe first mode of vibration now this is first mode of vibration this is lambda by 4 this is lambda by 4 lambda by 4 by lambda by 4 so the pattern of the fundamental modes of vibration is shown in figure lambda by 4 plus lambda by 4 is equal to 4 lambda plus lambda is equal to 2 lambda divided by 4 lambda by 2 so wavelength is equal to l is equal to lambda by 4 again L is equal to lambda by four plus lambda by four is equal to two lambda by four. L is equal to L is equal to lambda by two. So lambda is equal to two L. <coughs> Now. Lambda is equal to two L. So if length lambda one is equal to two L, frequency is equal to first case so right F one. F one is equal to V by lambda. So F one is equal to V by 
2L. This is for first mode of vibration. First mode of vibration. Second mode of vibration. This is second mode of vibration. Lambda by 4 plus lambda by 2. This is lambda by 2. This is lambda by 4 plus lambda by 4. This is equal to length. So L is equal to 4 lambda plus 2 lambda plus lambda is equal to 4 lambda by 4 L. So L is equal to lambda. L is equal to lambda. So if 2 is equal to V by lambda 2 V by L we derive that L is lambda 2 is equal to L so write 2V divided by 2L is equal to 2 in place of this we will write F1 so F1 is equal to F2 is equal to 2F1 <coughs> now in third case lambda by 2 lambda by 2 lambda by 4 lambda by 2 lambda by 2 lambda so this is lambda lambda 2 lambda total will become 2 lambda all right in detail L is equal to lambda by 2 plus lambda by 2 plus lambda by 4 plus lambda by 4. So we will add the whole wavelength. We, we will take LCM, then you will get 6 lambda by 4, and in simplified form, you will get this answer. This is the last answer. Now, I will write again this, the final relation. <coughs> L is equal to, L is equal to 3 lambda by 2. L is equal to so lambda is equal to 2L divided by 3. So F is equal to so F is equal to V divided by lambda 3. Third case, so write lambda 3. So this will be equal to. 2 lambda 2L divided by 3 is equal to 3V divided by 2L. Now, general relation is uh, we derived that F1 is equal to F1 is equal to V by 2L. If 2 is equal to 2V divided by 2L. If 3 is equal to 3V divided by 2L. So generally we can write Fn is equal to Nf1. Nf1. Now come towards close argon 5. This is close argon 5 which is closed at one end and open at the other end which is closed at one end and open at the other end is is called closed argon pipe now we know that in this case this is lambda by 4 so lambda by 4 is equal to l so l is equal to 4 lambda this is first case lambda 1 is equal to 4l 
this is first case huh? so write uh, if one is equal uh, I will erase and I will write again lambda 1 is equal to 4L so f1 is equal to v by lambda 1 so f1 is equal to v by 4L v by 4L now second case lambda by 4 lambda by 2 lambda by 2 this is lambda by 2 this is lambda by 4 so l will be equal to 3 lambda by 4 in second case now in second case lambda lambda is equal to lambda 2 lambda this is lambda 2 is equal to 4 l by 3 so if 2 is equal to v by lambda 2 is equal to v by 4 l into 3 so 3 into v by 4 l so if 2 is equal to 2 f or 3 f 1 now third harmonic the third and last harmonic this is lambda by 4 lambda by 2 lambda by 2 so lambda by 2 plus lambda by 2 plus lambda by 4 lambda by 4 lambda by 2 lambda by 4 so this is equal to l l is equal to this 4 2 lambda plus 2 lambda plus lambda 5 lambda by 4 For third harmonic you will write lambda by 2 lambda by 2 lambda by 4 so here we will write 4 2 lambda plus 2 lambda plus lambda is equal to 5 lambda by 4 is equal to L so lambda is equal to 4 L by 5 4 L by 5 so lambda 3 is equal to 4 L by 5 so V is equal to F lambda if 3 is equal to v by lambda 3 v 4 l divided by 5 is multiplied after simplification so if 3 is equal to 5 v divided by 4 l so if 3 is equal to 5 f1 so generally we can write that fn is equal to nf1 and fn is equal to nf1 power n is equal to 1, 3, 5, or multiple. Now students, I will explain Doppler effect, only definition I will explain. Doppler effect, and this chapter is finished. Doppler effect, the change in pitch of sound, the change in frequency, the change in frequency of sound, frequency of sound due to the relative motion R relative motion of either the source 
our listener either source of listener is called Doppler effect it's called Doppler effect now in application we, uh, if a star is moving away from you moving away star is moving away Now, if a star is moving away from the uh, observer, you will, its color will appear blue. You will see a blue shape. And red shape, respectively, uh, you can see the red, uh, red shape if it is moving towards. And Doppler shape. In the in the light is also used to determine the speed up of approaching star. Speed up recession with respect to the Earth known is blue shift or red shift. It is also used in radar. It is also used in radar also. Now, a general question for you people. Note. <coughs> do it. Try it. What we do? Question is what we do. Source is in motion if source is in motion wavelength changes wavelength changes use lambda prime is equal to lambda plus minus lambda <coughs> negative means towards positive means away observer is in motion observer is in motion is in motion number of wave changes Positive means towards, negative means away. Thank you, students. Allah Hafiz.